Uh, my name is Matt Pagajinski. I'm an ear, nose, throat surgeon. Altogether, I've done 24 mission trips. My most recent mission trip was to Guatemala. We were there for a week and uh, we did four days of operating. Uh, we saw all our patients on the first day, operated the next four, and then I had one day off to kind of regenerate. Um, I've done that trip for um, 13 years straight and then multiple other ones mixed in with that. The mission trips affect my day-to-day -day life at Presence Medical Group in that it shows me what pure medicine is. Um, you get to do what you love to do without having to worry about insurance companies, malpractice, or any of the other problems that come up in day-to-day -day life in medicine. And you get to use your talents to help people who otherwise would not have access to that type of care. One of the more memorable stories I had was a two-year-old we met in Honduras. Uh, he was born with a cleft lip and palate. He was able to eat but not speak well and obviously had an obvious facial deformity that everybody could see. We did a procedure where we repaired both the lip and the palate at the same time. And in the recovery room, the family came in to see him and really didn't recognize him because the lip was repaired. And then the first word out of his mouth was Papa, which the family had never heard before because you can't make the sound P when your palate is open. Um, it was truly gratifying to be able to see the family's reaction and realize that two hours of surgery can make that big of a difference. There are multiple ways to get involved with this. And Probably the simplest would be to contact the mission office here at uh, Presence Medical Group. The reason I do this every year is simply I love it and it reminds me why I went into medicine in the first place. Every year that I do it I come back feeling a lot more refreshed and energized and I would actually feel much worse if I ever missed a mission trip.